All right, so here we go. No armor. See, I can get overhead, cuts from this side, cuts from this side, probably some low and high cuts like that. No stabbing in armor. You can keep talking. Did Your you facts. Book of facts over here. Afraid of what? Eggs. Eggs. Did you? No. Why would he be afraid of eggs? Is he allergic to them? No. Huh? Did you know? No. Did you know scientists made medicine out of chocolate? Yeah, you said that one earlier. All right, so an armor. President James J. Garfield was fond of squirrels. No. In armor, we're going to be doing a lot of overheads. Probably cuts from this way, cuts from this way. Your normal middle house, like in armor, not so much. I don't think we're going to be doing any kind of over, under-handed. Uh, Whatever, like Hunter House. I believe that when I put this armor on here, you gotta start helping me soon. We're gonna put on the first bit of armor. So, unarmored, I have all kinds of, whoops, all kinds of mobility here, right? Stand closer to the camera so everyone can hear all your interesting facts. Did and then at home, everybody can say yes or no, too. Did you know <laughs> that, uh, the thing that's really going to cause some, some issues, I bet, when I have my helmet on, I don't think I'm going to get my hands up this side. Did you know that during Olympic training, swimmer Michael, Michael Phelps, Phelps. Phelps consumed more than 12,000 calories a day? Yeah. I actually did know that. Did you know Christopher Columbus brought the first lemon seeds to America? Brought the first what? Lemon seeds. The first lemon seeds now. Did you know that oh, parts, I can't cross my hands. Did you know that parts 
of US and California. I mean, did you know that parts of California, USA are shrinking? Or what? Sinking. Yeah, probably gonna be covered. By the time you're my age, it might be covered in, in water. In Florida. So. Like this? Not here. We're way up in the oh. way up in uh, sea, above sea level. Did you know that? So, in so the Zealand? arm armor makes it ha harder to use, and I can't cross my arms, so I've already lost some mobility. What? Did you know that honeybees? What's happening? <laughs> so, I uh, I actually have some skinnier arm protection coming in the mail, but at the moment. Like, it is so hard to get, I can't get it up higher than this, which I would get hit in the head. Over here? Sure. With the long swing. Huh? One of the people says, with the long swing. Yeah, well, I do plenty of long sword stuff. I have no protection on this side. Look at this, I can't get my hands any higher. Did you... No. So I'm going to have to consider that. And of course, uh, uh, I think other people out here are getting great swords now. So Thank we're going to have a brand new category, Persephone. And, and you're helping come with me to our next event. Did you know next that weekend. a honeybee has the same number of hairs What's as a squirrel? Three million. Three million. And scientists are developing. Yeah. And scientists are developing robot bees that could artificially pollinate crops. Uh, robot honey ba bees yeah. that can... Yeah, because we're, lo we're losing bee population too. It's probably a good thing they're doing that. Did you know that bacteria talk to each other? Yeah, I guess so. Did you know that a chicken wing is a bad golf swing? A what? A chicken wing is a bad golf swing. No, I didn't. I bet people out there know a chicken wing is a bad golf swing. Did you know that snails smell, smell with their lips? Do? Snails. Smell with their lips? No. Did you even know that snails have lips? I mean, I guess. Did you know that? They have to eat, right? Did you know that in 1904, World Fair featured a life-size elephant made of almonds? No. Did you know that? Here, here, you have to help me get this. So you have to help me get this next part. Did of you know that an elephant <laughs> is is elephant's tooth is um as big as a brick? As big as a brick? No. Did you know chocolate was one way? Uh, you probably know that. And then some. Oh, and, and if anybody's tuned in, I think Boris, if you're still there, everybody okay. sees Boris on here. Did you know? I think you're the one that said, good luck swinging this sword around for 60 seconds. He is. And I think you're right. Yeah. He is. I just, because um, it, is, it is a little tiring already. Just with this arm armor on. I can swing that thing around all day without it, but. Alright, here, this is fine. Wait. Please, please help me get this done. The sooner we get this done, the sooner we get the hobby lobby. That, there's a comment too, but I love it now. Uh-huh. No, no, no. Alright. Alright. So now we've got the added weight. Still, this is without gauntlets. Gauntlets are next. Gauntlets are going to be the worst part because you know how I com Daddy complains about not being able to move my hands. With my gauntlets. I'm good at swinging a two handed axe, but. An 18 foot long Batmobile out of more than 50,000 Legos. Legos? Yeah. But even like for sword and shield, I have a limited mobility. That's why we have some better arms coming. All right, so now we got the armor on. I have an East. Yeah, it's like Eastern kit, but it's, um, you yeah, know, it wouldn't pass. Totally historic. What does? It's from fish scales? Ancient fish scales. Say, say that so everybody can hear that one. That's interesting. 
Tooth enamel evolved from ancient fish scales. Tooth enamel. So we're, we're, we have fish, fish scale DNA or something, huh? Mm -hmm. What does? Fidgeting. What does? Fidgeting. Fidgeting makes you healthier? Yeah. I guess. Yeah, who could see that? Ah, I can't get my arms up higher than this over here. So this side, I'm going to have to do a lot of blocking like this. I didn't know that, but I can guarantee you nobody out, nobody out in TV, TV land can hear your facts. Did you know the longest pizza ever made was almost a mile long? A mile long pizza. Did you know global, global warming is changing the shape of the earth when it's raining? Is changing what? The shape of the earth. Changing the shape of the earth. No. What are bono What are they? I don't know. I um. So I'm finding. I think. I think we're gonna do a lot of uh, sword. Can you read that? I think we're going to do a lot of transition between long edge and short edge because to get, to get, all right, now of course this is just me, but to get into a, some kind of like, some kind of, unless I hit somebody, if I miss, it's, it's very hard to cross my arms and fall off with something like, like this. Actually, it's not. I can't even get it on edge this way. So I'm gonna have to work on a lot of like shifting between long edge and short edge. So if I miss, I'm gonna have to think of some because I I could come up like this, but that's. So if, if I miss coming this way, I make it to my friend. Huh? I, I'm looking for my friend. I'm looking for Gabriella. Hey, there she is. Look what I can do. <laughs> you know what that is? I don't. A baboon lemon? Yeah. A baboon lemon. Yeah. 
I have no mobility this way. This is Persephone. This is how high I can get my hands. <laughs> ah, okay. <laughs> On this side. Alright, I'm protected there. This side. Nope. Did you know that Jack With gauntlets, gauntlets, I can't even get my hands back this way. This is the range of motion I got. On this side. This side's not so bad. But, and, and you might know this from all the videos and stuff I wa I've watched Persephone. These swords are meant to swing around like a madman in every direction possible against multiple people. And in armor, my armor, I'm very limited now. Look, so here's... Did you, wait, did you know thing is the official sport of the so US? This, I, I, can't of hear, the I can't hear right now. Did you know that wrestling is the official sport of the U.S. state of Maryland? I didn't know that. Did you know that pumpkins almost went extinct? Did you know that the state vegetable of Oklahoma USA is the watermelon? I, I can't hear anything, so I'll have to catch up with you later. Did you know that the U.S. state of Kansas produces roughly every year to make 35 billion loaves of bread? Did you know that humans have explored less than 5% of the ocean? Humans have what? Explore less than five percent of the ocean. Yeah. Did you? Oh man, I can't do my best. I th I thought my combo and armor was gonna be able to go do a bunch of these. I have an earworm. This and then the other side. I have an earworm. I have an earworm. I have an earworm stuck in my ear. A what? Earworm. Do you have earwax stuck in your ear? No, earworm. Did you know that earworm is a sound That's, that's a very good, easy combo to do without using a lot of energy. Did you know the first living things on Earth were bacteria? Yeah. Did you know that pumpkins almost went extinct? No. Did you know that the state vegetable of Oklahoma, USA is the watermelon? Yeah. Did you know a man in Spain has ribs made by a 3D printer? A what? A man in Spain has ribs uh, made by a 3D printer? No. I'm, I'm not surprised though, you know? I bet when you're older, There'll be a lot of stuff like that. Did you know that the sun has holes in it? Did you? This is going to be my... <laughs> Did you know that the sun has holes in it? What does? The sun has holes in it. I, I guess. Did you know that... About nine trillion pieces of candy corn will be made this year. Did you know that President Theodore Roosevelt used to box in the White House? Did you know Not that sorting. President Theodore Roosevelt used to box in the White House? No. Did you know that? Snakes once had legs. Did you know that snakes once had legs? 
I guess. Did you know that? I wonder. Ed, I wonder what would have changed. Did you know that a U.S. university has thousands of brains stored in a bank? No. I mean a brain bank. Did you know the sea bunny is actually a slug? All right, so, so I think the final test here in armor, which is why I'm glad you helped me. Thank you for helping me get into it because I learned just how limited I am. Did you know Pluto is I'm going to have to guard my right side Did you know with, that? with my blade. Left side. Did you know that? Left side, I can cover my whole head. Did you know that Pluto is only about as wide as the United States. No, I didn't. So this, I have motion from here. I have motion from here. I have motion. I can't get this up above my head. So, so no overhead chopping from daddy. Did you know this that? is as high as I get my arms. Did you know that scientists designed I got that direction. I got the, the middle. Did you? I can't get my hands any farther back than this over here. Did you Which know? hopefully the new arm armor will be skinny enough to work for these gauntlets. Now I'm going to take some of this off if you can help me. And we'll get down just to did, finish the video and close. Did you guys know that scientists designed the tractor beam that can pick up and move? Small objects using sound waves. I didn't know that. made a battery using mushrooms, you said, right? Scientists. Did you know the average American eats about a ton of food each year? Use what? A ton of food each year. What does? The average American. An actual What do they do? Americans, did you say? Yeah. The largest muscle in your body is gluteus maximus. That's, that's your butt. Here, get closer so everybody can hear. You're walking around. I'm, I'm telling you, nobody can hear. I watch these videos later, nobody can hear me if I'm not that, that close. Did grab a bite and one of these towns. U.S. Towns, Oatmeal, Texas, Sandwich, Massachusetts. Sandwich, Massachusetts? Yeah. There's a place called Sandwich, Massachusetts? Yeah. <laughs> no, like, Oatmeal is a town in Texas. Sandwich is a town in Massachusetts. Pie Town is in New Mexico. Burnt Corn is in Alabama. There's a place called Burnt Corn? Yeah. Chicken is in Alaska and Cookie Town is in Oklahoma. There's a place called Cookie Town? Yeah. There's a place called Cookie Town, USA. Cookie Town! Cookies will cookies we'll see. <laughs> right? Mm. Maybe that's where Cookie Thrill C lives. Did you know that too much oxygen can make you sick? Yeah. Actually, I deal with that at work sometimes, Persephone. Did you know that you become temporarily paralyzed while you dream? Yeah. Did you ever wake up while you're paralyzed during a dream? I have one. It can be scary. Best thing to do is just go back to bed. What, what happened? Well, so you are dreaming. Let me get, these, let me get this leg armor off, because I don't want to wear this into Hobby Lobby and see if anybody was commenting. 
Oh. Oh, yeah, if you just tuned in, you missed the armor part. How fast can I chop, level back, and, oh, I can't see. <laughs> that, see, that's, a, maybe I can get this out of here. Let me get to the comments, and then I'm gonna just swing it around a little bit and close, plain close. Keep reading your facts. Chop, level back, and chop again. We will have to find that out. Someone tried to auction off New Zealand. Yeah. Who was it? All right, here we go. Get these legs off. Two hundred fourteen people inside the Two hundred how many people? Fourteen. Two hundred fourteen people fit inside the world's largest soap bubble. Yeah. I did not know that. That's crazy. Did you know? <laughs> Horses don't throw up. I know that. How do you, oh, I guess you know that. You ride horses. You know a lot about horses. Did you know Snickers bar was named after a horse? Snickers bar is named after a horse? Did you know Star Wars came out and invented originally in the United Kingdom and were originally called opal fruits? Yeah. Opal fruits? Yeah. Starburst. Uh huh. I didn't know that. Did you know there are more than 400 words for spelling Scotland? 400 words for spelling Scotland? No, 400 words for snow. Oh, for snow. Well, I guess that could be. That seems like a lot, though, doesn't it? Yeah. Did you know October 9th is National Moldy Cheese Day in the U.S.? October 9th is National Moldy Cheese Day. Oh, hey, yeah, and so I was out there swinging this around. You know something that's going to happen? If you buy a great sword, you better get a stock of leather strips because do you know how many people are going to block like this? Right? I was just thinking that. This is in front of my face. I can't get my hands in armor up over my head, so I may be trying to block a shot. It's going to chew up these grips like you can't believe. So you, I can't tell what's under here, but just looking at barely, I bet it's... I would imagine it's wood, you know, if you've never undone a grip. Did you, know? you undo this, there's wood, and it's usually like spray glued or something to there. What I usually do is I take off all leather. I take like a putty knife to gently try and peel the wood off. You, if you had, if you have to fix a loose cross guard, you jam that wood up to the cross guard to keep it steady. Um, and then you spray glue the wood and put it back on and uh, spray glue the leather. But these the grips are gonna get chewed apart because there is so much so much distance between your hands and people are gonna smack the crap out of these grips. Did you know that an ancient Chinese warrior is said to have stunned enemy troops into retreat by juggling nine balls at once? So a, a, a soldier scared, scared what? An ancient Chinese warrior is said to have stunned enemy troops into retreat by juggling nine balls at once. Now, did you know U.S. President Barack Obama's dog Bo is featured on a baseball card? No. Wait, a baseball card? So Barack Obama's dog is on a baseball card? I wonder what one. We should look that up. I bet it's probably worth something. I, I have some comics of, with him in it. <laughs> Did you know Burma, Liberia, and the United States are only are the only countries in the world that haven't adopted the metric system? Which countries is it? The United States, Liberia, and Burma. Really? What's the metric system? The metric system is the one you learn with all the, the numbers that are like 100, like kilograms, centimeters, you know all those, right? You know, like for math class, uh, you'll probably be, we were measuring eighths. Remember all that stuff we measured when, when I showed you that tape measure a couple weeks ago and eighths, quarters, sixteenths, all that stuff? This is the only country that does that. <laughs> if you went to England and you said, hey, uh, 
how, how long is your sword? And he said, five foot three inches and three sixteenths. They would say, what? Because we measure it in some, like, like somebody, honestly, how do you come up with how many feet are in a mile? Like, I don't even know. And I'm 42 years old because it's so stupid because it's some number like 4,578. You know what I mean? In, in metric system, everything's in hundreds. Like how far, uh, 100, 100 kilometers, you can convert that into centimeters if you want to, millimeters in your head. If you wanted to convert miles into feet or something here in the U.S., you gotta be like, <laughs> you get it? They found sharks in an underwater volcano. Living. Huh? Living. Living one. A lot. 